What's the first thing you do when you get into your garage forward slash workshop? Anything like me? Get some tunes on. <laughs> That's, uh, I can't even remember who makes that now. K Sound, it's a Hive by K Sound. Not a bad little speaker. Bluetooth to the phone, or the phone Bluetooth to it. Anyway, a company called Herdio sent me an email, would you like to sample some of our products? So I said yes, quite keen into the old music, like a bit of music on while we're working. Obviously I don't have a lot of music playing when we're videoing because of copyright strikes. Um, they asked me what sort of size the building was and they've sent me out some weatherproof, waterproof, outdoor speakers. So let's open the box and see what comes inside. So this is the H H O S 601. Six and a half inch two-way waterproof indoor outdoor speakers. Two-way full range stereo speakers with one PEI dome tweeter. Speaker power output, 400 watts. Mm. Marine grade waterproof construction. Custom tool design for high power, removable and anti-rust speaker grills. Heavy duty engineered plastic cabinet. Applications, indoor and outdoor. Product dimensions. Length, width, height, blah, blah, blah. Made in China. Everything comes from China nowadays, doesn't it? I was probably in my own light there. But yeah, let's uh, crack the box open and see what's inside. polystyrene there look quite well packaged there's two of them that's a power lead Transformer, AC to DC adapter, two speakers with brackets on the back of them. Right, I'll get these set up on the bench and we'll see about wiring them up. So these are 400 watts, so 200 watt speaker. Now you've got an active speaker and you've got a passive speaker. So the active speaker gets the power going to it. In here, there's a little socket, pull that cover off. That Take this little t twist tie off. That plugs into there, like so. And then that will go to the mains. Now, with the supplied speaker cable, we'll untwist this. All you do is just slacken these screws off. Pull that out while we're doing this. So with this speaker cable, you've got a black and a red. So it goes black to black, red to red. Couldn't get much more straightforward than that. Now I've seen a lot of people on YouTube videos with these speakers put extra cabling, but they do recommend that they're only eight feet apart from each other. Um, whether that's something to do with the impedance or what, I don't know.
So in there, there's in that brass post, there is a hole. Um, so I've just bent the end of the cable out a little bit, gone down through that the centre there, poke it out of the hole. Easier said than done. That's that one wired up. Now it's got little feet on the bottom. So for now, I'm just going to be standing them on here. Um, eventually, I will be mounting them on the wall over there. But for today's purposes, I'm just going to set it up on the bench. Now, if, you can just pull these wires apart a little bit like that if you need to. Right, so I'm just going to plug the power back in. Chop that over there out of the way. This power thing comes with a cable. It just plugs into there like so. <coughs> and then we'll plug that into the extension cable. Bluetooth mode. Bluetooth mode. Right. Let me just do a screen recording and see how easy it is to. Uh... Right. Go to settings, Bluetooth. It should say. Herdio or HOS 601, we'll touch that. Connected. Okay, you now that's loud. Right, see what they sound like. I'm gonna have to use some, uh, some songs off YouTube, otherwise I get copyrighted. 
So let's just go for this one first. Do the volume on the phone. Control the volume on your phone. There's no, there's no controls on the actual speakers themselves, so it's all done off your device. They actually, in person, sound really good. I turn, I crank the volume up, I don't know if the camera, the, I've got a decent microphone on this camera, but um, whether that'll pick it up. No distortion whatsoever. Nice tight bass. Um, yeah, good sound, especially for an outdoor speaker. So I'm gonna mount them up on the wall over there, either side of that Ben's Garage banner. Um, but I ain't doing that today. I'd have to clear all that stuff out and then we, we are going to be finishing this wall off at some point. Links will be in the description for these. Um, I'm not uh, hoping that this channel doesn't s start sounding like an, a shopping channel, but they sent them to me. There is an affiliate program. I have signed up to it. So if you use that link, we get a little bit of a benefit. You don't pay any extra, but we get a little bit of a kickback. So I am feeling slightly better today. It was our birthday yesterday. My, uh, my birthday, oh, Tina's birthday, Ludo's birthday, the the number one mutt. It was Kira's birthday on 1st of March, Friday. And I've been as rough as arseholes this weekend. <laughs> I'm just sort of getting over it now. A bit, I don't know, I've not had a cold for like four years. Um, and I'm hopefully I haven't spread lurgies to the Hobbit. I'd, Christ knows where I've got it from, because I don't go anywhere. It's other people that come to the house. Having said that, the Hobbit goes out, so she might have brought the germs home to me. So yeah, they're quite good, these speakers. They do sound really good. Obviously, I only had to, I could only use them. Um, let me just switch this off. Still screen recording. Um, yeah, I can only use YouTube music, so I will have a listen to some proper music on it in a minute. And um, yeah, so far so good. They seem pretty good. Um, well built, so they are waterproof, weatherproof, so they can go outside. Um, yeah, check out the link below. Affiliate link, whatever. I don't know if there's a discount, I can't remember, but anyway, 
my head isn't quite in the game today so that's gonna be it for this video um i do like a bit of music in the garage uh, a quiet garage isn't a very productive garage <laughs> So yeah, we <coughs> oh fucking hell. Yeah, we do like a bit of m music in the workplace, shall I say? Um, so yeah, if you fancy what anything like this, they do loads of stuff. They do passive speakers. So if you wanted more, and they do like a, an amplifier, so you can have four speakers. It's all Bluetooth. Uh, other stuff as well, ceiling speakers, this, that, and the other. They're too much to mention. Have a look on their website. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give a big thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye for now.